Hey guys, welcome back to Morrowind Overhaul version 3.0. My name is Zach, and we are here with Mr. Caius Corsetes, the shirtless wonder, probably for the last time. I'm gonna miss you, Caius. Anyway, I'm still recovering from a bit of corpora, so I went ahead and bought a whole bunch of restore potions. So you can see personality, speed, strength. Uh, what else have I got? Restore. No, no, that's not right. Uh, ah, I have some of these exclusives. Agility, Endurance, and Intelligence. And I think those are all that I bought. Oh, and a cheap Restore Luck. Because I'm not too sure what's really afflicting me, so I just went ahead and bought all of them. And let's let those take effect. Ah, shiny potions. And we should be back to maximum. As you can see, these new Fists of Randagolf, the best gauntlets in the game were boosting my stats and looks like we are back to tip-top shape so lovely gloves there they are anyway we're here for our final orders okay come on Caius thank you for your report I've uh, been recalled to the Imperial City I'm promoted to operative and I'll head the blades and we're here for my final orders now I have to continue to pursuing the Nervarine prophecies as the Emperor commands. First, go to the Hall of Wisdom and Justice and get Mehra Milo to help you find the lost prophecies. She's being watched. If something has gone wrong, find her private quarters. She'll leave you a message there under the code word Amaya. Then take the lost prophecies to Nibani Maesa. From that point, you'll have to follow her directions and follow the prophecies. Good luck. Well, sounds pretty straightforward. Uh-huh. Lost prophecies. So, yes. Um, we just have to go to Vivek, I think. Find Mehra Milo, or, and then probably something has happened. And we have to go to her private quarters and bring the lost prophecies I get from her to Nibani Maesa, which is all the way back at the Urshilaku camp, which is going to be a pain. Anyway... We just have to head on to Vivek and find out if Mehra Milo is okay. Okay, so we just took the Silt Strider over to Vivek City. It's a lovely dawn, as you can see over there. The sun is rising over the hills. And we're here back at Vivek City. We haven't been here for quite some time. But uh, Mehra Milo is all the way at the back. So let me just head on over to that main quarters area and see if I can find her back in that library. Okay, here we are back at the main temple area of Vivek. Uh, sun is a little higher than before, so you know how long I've been walking. So now she's supposed to be in the Hall of Wisdom, which I think I remember is this one. There we go, Hall of Wisdom. Now, Mehra Milo, don't suppose you know anything while I'm here? No, I can't ask you anything about her. Okay, goodbye. So we are just looking for where we went to last time, which should be the library of Vivek. It's right up here on the right, which is, yep, library of Vivek. And this is where she helped us last time, but I have a feeling something has gone Go wrong. Ahead, what do you need? Um, Mehra Milo? She works here in the library. If she's not here right now, you might find her in her private quarters. Her door is across from the cannon offices here in the Hall of Wisdom. Okay. Across from the cannon offices. Where did I come in from? Is it here? Hall of Wisdom? Where does this go then? Also Hall of Wisdom. Okay, cannon offices. There we go. Cannon offices just in... Ah, there it is. Vivek Milo's quarters. So it should be right this way, if I'm not mistaken. Milo's quarters lock level 20. That is a little inconvenient, especially with that guard there. Unless he moves, I'm not going to be able to unlock this door. I'm going to look around to see if I can find a way in. Okay, so I made the guard look over that way. And I was looking through my inventory and I saw a few things actually that I have. I have a master's lockpick, but I also have this scroll of Onduzi's Unhinging, which should do the trick to opening up this uh, door. So I'm just going to try sneak here and try cast the spell on the door. And it's been... Ooh, he did not notice, so I'm not going to have to fight anyone here. So let's head on into Mehra Milo's personal quarters. 
Now, what was the secret code? It was like a, a Maya. There, there we go. So, leave a message under the code word Amaya. Uh, well, let's see. Anything in the chest? No. In the sack? No. It could be under the pillow? No. Um, that's I'm just looking through all of these urns and pots. Oh, the Pilgrim's Path. Oh, note to Amaya. Aha. I thought it was going to be under the pillow. Okay, Amaya. So that's me. Sorry I missed you. I had to run some old documents over to the Inquisitor at the Ministry of Truth. And I'm likely to be tied up there for a while. Why don't you meet me there as soon as you can? Then we can leave together as soon as I'm done. And Amaya, don't forget to bring me the two Divine Intervention Scrolls you borrowed. Or, if you use them, buy a couple of new ones for me. I think I'm going to need them soon. Janand Mol... Molini at the Mages Guild in the Foreign Quarter keeps them in stock. Alvelash Saram is the guard at the entrance. Just tell her you're looking for me and she'll let you in. Your faithful friend, Mehra. P.S. I left a couple of levitate potions here for you just in case. I couldn't remember if you knew the spell or not. So I drew a couple from stock. Okay, so I have to go meet her at the Ministry of Truth and I also have to bring two divine intervention scrolls which I can buy from Janand at the Mages Guild at the Foreign Quarter. Okay, so there's the Rising Force potions, Levitate. I'm gonna take those. I'm not missing anything else here. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the Foreign Quarter and shop for those scrolls. Okay, here we go up into the Foreign Quarter Plaza and this is where the Mages Guild should be. And I should... Ah, there we go. The Mages Guild. And... Or rather, Guild of Mages. And here I should be able to... There we go. Janand Morlinier? Whatever. Barter. And I actually looked into my inventory and I actually have one scroll of divine intervention. So I just have to buy one more. Let's see where it is. Divine intervention. There we go. She's got two. So I'm just going to buy both, just in case. Bit of barter, offer that. There, now we have three scrolls of divine intervention, and now we just have to go to the Ministry of Truth to meet up with Mehra Milo. That should be back at the main place where I was just now. Okay, here we are back at this main temple area, and I was thinking, she gave me two levitate potions, so... The Hall of Truth must be up there. Huh, on that floating rock which is inexplicably just up there. So for, uh, rather than using my Ring of Floating, I'm gonna use that uh, Quality Rising Force Potion since we have so many already. There we go. Now let's float up on here and we should be able, well, I mean this should be the Hall of Truth where she said she should be. Uh, let's see if we can use this door. We have to go higher up. This says... come on then. Uh, Hall of Processing, lock level 80. So that's not right. It must be up here then. Let's just get onto this platform. And... ooh, there's someone here. Who are you? What do you think of our city, Outlander? Uh, it's very nice. Alvela Saram. I'm sorry, no pilgrims allowed in the ministry. Uh, but you're not here to visit anyone, are you? Ah, oh, Mehra said you would come. Oh, this is the guard, which is, she said was outside. I'll stay. Say you subdued me with magic and stole my key. It opens all three exterior doors. The upper back door is best. You'll need other keys for the doors inside. Search for the keys in desks. No one carries keys while on duty. Mehra is in the prison keep in the cell on the far right. Mehra said you'll bring scrolls to get out. Oh, she's actually been imprisoned. Some of us are sympathetic to the dissident priest, but kill an ordinator and you'll lose that sympathy. You got rank in the temple, maybe you can bluff your way through. Here's the key to the entrance, now get going. Okay, so this is actually a prison break. Um, so, uh, I guess we should just head on in and see if we encounter any trouble. Here we go into the Ministry of Truth. And this doesn't look very pleasant at all. But I'm not sure if we're going to be able to bluff our way through this. I, uh, of course, I did save. Um, but yes, what did she say? She's like all the way inside one of the prison cells. Uh, huh. 
Well, let's um, quickly get into this place and try not to get ourselves killed. Okay, these guards don't seem to chase me when they're walking by, but I expect if I walk up to them, they will say something. I'm just trying to look for those uh, desks with keys in them. Oh, I shouldn't be going by that person. Oh no, um... Can I... Can I talk to you? Uh, no, I don't think I can. I'm just gonna try run away. Uh, <laughs> okay, there's a locked door here, but I do have a scroll of Onduzi's unhinging. So let me just unlock this and run through that. And yes, I'm gonna uh, probably be <laughs> chased to my death here, but I cannot kill an ordinator. Uh, I have another Onduzi's unhinging, but not too many of them. Oh, there's some... There's a guy in here, and he might attack me on sight, so I'm just trying to hide. Okay, let's look around for some desks and keys here. Actually, I wonder if I can talk to this guy. Grand Inquisitor. Oh, I don't care who you are or why you're here. No one comes in here without proper authorization. Now get out while you can. Um... Am I supposed to believe such a tale? God sees him! Okay, I cannot talk to him. But no I can grab the Ministry of Truth sector key before you kill me. And then I'm gonna have to r run away! Oh, okay. He packs quite a punch. Oh, I'm gonna die here. Uh, let's uh, restore some health. I don't have many of these. Uh, restore health, restore health. Do I have anything a bit... Quality Restore Health, okay. That should keep me alive. And close the door, and let's run away in a Vivek Temple. Okay, that is, um... Oh, I'm right here. <laughs> I actually went in the back door and I'm, I'm here again. Okay, let me just check once again. Uh, don't shed ordinator blood. Okay, yes, um... Huh, okay. So I got a key, didn't I? Ministry of Truth Sector Key. So let's head back in here. And I'm still under attack. So, um... Actually, let me just check the map and maybe I can see Ministry of Truth Sector on here. No? Oh, Prison Keep. That's where I want to go. Okay, I wonder if I can make it. I'm gonna try my best here. Okay, here's a new door. Ministry of Truth Sector Key. I'm on the outside again. And it's a... it's a dead end. Okay, so... We gotta head back in here. It's on the map there. Prison Key, but I can't find my way up there. Ah, here's a new door. This should be it. Prison Keep. Yes, I got the Ministry of Truth Sector Key that leads me in here. Ah... Uh, ah... Uh, okay, so... There's a bunch of guards here, and I think Mehra Milo's at the back. So let's see if I can deal with this rabble. Whoa, let's jump across this. Oh, let's jump. Oh no, I'm being hit pretty hard. Mehra Milo, are you here? That's not you. You must be in one of these holding cells. Uh, looks like they're kind of stuck. I can't remember which holding cell it was. Okay, time to equip the master's lockpick and start undoing these cells. Let's see, are you in here? Mehra Milo, is that you? That doesn't look like you. No, <laughs> wrong uh, cell, sorry. Uh, it's locked on the inside and the outside. Okay, how about this cell? In we go. Mehra Milo, no, that doesn't look like you either. Ilden Mirel. Uh, nothing much. Goodbye. Uh, why is it locked on the inside as well? There's double locks. How do I get in? Okay, last cell. Come on, then. Mehra Milo, there you are. Mehra Milo, do you have the divine intervention scrolls? I have an escape plan. You better. There's guards outside. I'll need one divine intervention scroll for myself for my escape plan. Getting out will be a lot faster and safer for you if you have one. But if you haven't got one for yourself, maybe you can find some other way out. No, I got one, I got one, I got an extra one too. Now listen, here's my plan. Give me a divine intervention scroll. I'll meet you at the secret dissident priest's monastery at Holamayan for safety. We'll, uh, for safety, we'll travel separately. Okay. When you get out of here, look for a woman named Blata. 
Eberhard Terrier on the east docks of Ebenhard. I'll tell her I sent you and that you want to go fishing. She'll bring you to Hola Mayan by boat. I'll meet you there and we'll get the lost prophecies from Gilvas Barello, the leader of the dissident priests. And magic conceals the Hola Mayan entrance. Speak to Vevrana Arion, a monk at the dock. At, okay, this is way too confusing. I hope it's in my journal. Yes. So, okay. What do these scrolls do I then? Uh, okay, we, I guess we just... Uh, when you get out of here, uh, we have to escape. Okay, what do these scrolls actually do? Um, scroll of Divine Intervention. What does Divine Intervention actually cause? It just says Divine Intervention on Self. Maybe it stops people from attacking me. I guess I can try that. Let's see what happens. Okay, we're under attack. Let's cast this. Oh, it actually teleports us. Wow, nice. And we are... Where are we? We're at um, Ebenhard. Wow. Okay. Um, well, that's nice and convenient. Well, uh, okay, let me just equip my sword back on. Where is it? Uh, Umbra sword. And... I guess we're safe. So now we just have to uh, at meet her at Holamayan. Uh, I'll go to the East Docks in Ebenhart to find Blata Hateria. Okay, East Docks. That's this way. And let's see if we can find this person. Ah, <laughs> look at that. There's the rock we were stuck in. I'm so happy I didn't have to run out of that. I, I didn't know what Divine Invention does, but I guess it just teleports you to another city or something? I should test that out later. Some of you guys probably know what it already does, so uh, no need me to show you or explain it. But let's look for this person. There we go, Blata. Yes, I'm Blata Hateria. Do I know you? Right, yes. Uh, my friend said you might want to go fishing. I know a fine place. Excellent fishing. Mehra Milo says it's a favorite fishing spot. You ready to go? Yes, I am. Let's head on over. I'll take you to home anytime you're ready to travel. And I'll be there to offer my services. And So can I just travel there? Azura Coast Region. Is that it? Good afternoon. Let's see. Uh, ready to take me anytime. And ready to... Oh, sure. Offer. Okay, cool. So I can just take this boat anytime to Homalaya. And, uh, well, it says Azura's Coast Region. So let's just travel there and see... If it is actually to the right spot. And uh, Vevrana Arion. I think she was mentioned. Yes. Uh, did that name come up? I think so. Yes, I'm Vevrana Arion. A monk of the Holamayan... Uh, of Homalayan. The monastery is here on this island. Take the stone path north from the docks and the path uphill. The entrance is hidden by a magical shield. Wait or rest at the head of the path. And the portal will open at dusk or dawn only. The magical twilight hours uh, sacred to Azura. Mehra Milo has told us of your coming. You can find her in the library with Master Barello. Later, I can arrange for your return to Vivek whenever you're ready. Your return to Vivek? Uh, no, no, I'm not re ready to return quite yet. So, follow the stone path uphill and wait until it's dawn or dusk. I guess this is the stone path, so let's head on up. It looks like it's a little bit of a way. Oh, I've actually gained a level from being hit by that rat. Uh, gained a level of medium armor, and looks like this is a nice place infested by rats, though. Jeez. Um, but I followed the stone path up here, and this must be the entrance. Okay, so I'm just going to have to wait here. It's 11 p.m. So let's say 5 a.m. will be dawn. Uh, that means we. this is 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's 6 hours from now. Let's... Uh, oh, we can actually rest here then. And that should be dawn and... Oh, it looks like I'm not going <laughs> to... I did actually level up. Uh, but uh, let's just put some stats into here. Strength's always good. Um, willpower, agility, speed, I could move a bit faster and I could do with a bit more agility. There we go. Okay, we'll take that and what time is it? 5 a.m. But I guess it's not considered 
dawn yet. Let's wait one more hour. And this should make it. There we go. Entrance opening. Let's put away our sword. 6 a.m. Dawn. In we go to the Holamayan Monastery. Ooh, this is quite exciting. Not too much combat anymore after that ordinator ordeal. Let's see. We're not supposed to talk to you. Uh, told us you're coming. You can find her in the library with Master Borello. Uh, okay, so I just have to head to the library. Let me go find out where that is. Uh, I'm sure they are. Looks like there's quite a few people here, but these aren't the people I'm looking for. Uh, looks like, oh. They actually do some alchemy over here. What so maybe it's there? down this way, and... Yes, I see some books. This should be the library. Ah, there you go. Mehra Milo! Thank you for rescuing me! Now I'll stay here at Holamayan with Master Borello and assist him with the monastery's library. Oh, okay, it's a much smaller library though, it seems like. Caius Corsetas? Caius has gone back to the Imperial City. Yes, he says he's been recalled. I wonder. I never know what he's thinking. I think he's involved in something secret, something dangerous. I'm, I was hoping he might help us. Now he's gone, I don't know what to think. Okay, so we are looking for... Uh, let's see. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to talk to the master over there. Happy to make your acquaintance. You better be. I saved your life. Uh, okay. Gilvas Barello. Let's see. How can I help you? The Lost Prophecies. Yes. I have reviewed the Apographa and have found two passages of particular interest. We've made copies of these passages to give you. Many are familiar with the two Nerevarine prophecies current among the Ashlanders, called the Stranger and the Seven Vision. We have two other prophecies, the Lost Prophecy and the Seven Curses, that may offer additional insights into the riddles surrounding the coming of the Incarnate. Perhaps these are the Lost Prophecies that your friend Nibani Maesa told you about. I wouldn't call her my friend, really. Um, we have prepared a document for you called Kagrenax Tools. This, this document will explain to you and to others the terrible secret that the temple conceals about the true history of the tribunal and the corrupt nature of their divine powers. It is to conceal the secret that the temple persecutes the Nervarine and the dissident priests. This persecution must stop. We must be united against the true enemy Degath Ur. And if you are the Nerevarine, you must lead us against him. Wow, okay. Let's uh, grab a few things to add to our journal. So long as the ordinance is that's about Degath Ur, Nerevarine. Uh huh, as a principle, we need to consider validity. Mm hmm. Six house. Oh, there's lots of new information here. This is a new threat. If you guys want to read all this, you can. The Apographa. All of this is being added to my journal, so I can read this later. Dissident Priests. Wow, okay, he's just giving me everything I need to know. Pause the video if you want to... Ooh, Nerva. He actually adds more stuff here. Um, the real Nerva... Ah, this is something. By the way, here are a few books from our library you might find of interest. Each gives a very different impression of Nerva. Very nice. Nerva, Moon and Star has been added to inventory. Are these books? Because I remember I need a symbol of the Moon and Star on me. Uh, oh, the Lost Prophecy. Oh, do you guys want to read it? I guess you can... It's not too long. I've annotated your copy of the Lost Prophecy. Nice, thanks. Let me just read this poetry for you. From seventh sign of eleventh generation, neither hound nor guar, nor seed nor harrow, but dragon born and far star marked, Outlander incarnate beneath Red Mountain. Blessed guest counters seven curses. Star-blessed hand wields thrice-cursed blade to reap the harvest of the unmourned house. There you go. It sounds quite interesting. And I think that's all I can get from you guys here. The seven curses. Oh, this one's slightly longer, which I don't think I'll read it this time. But I've got that now in my inventory. Uh, lots of curses there. Okay, so I think that's all I can get from him. Yes, uh, don't click on that again. Yes, okay, there we go. So now that I've got all of that stuff, I probably have to read these books. 
Seven Wages, Strangers, uh, this is the real Nerva, Lost Prophecy, Saint Nerva, Nerva, Moon and Star. What is this, a book? Yes, it is. Huh, okay. And basically, now that I've got all of this, I have to go back to the Urshilaku camp and uh, try and prove myself to be the Nerva. Quit your grumbling. Um, okay, so I think I will end this video here, and in the next episode, I'm gonna head over to the Ushilaku camp, and I'm pretty confident I will prove myself to be the Nerevarine. Anyway, that's it for now. I'll see you in the next video.